Sitting on 200 hectares of land at Walilanji in Mchinji, the farm is one of the biggest commercial plantations of giant bamboo in southern Africa. Managed by Afribam, the plantation places Malawi as an emerging potential producer of bamboo-based charcoal, blockboard and engineered timber for the construction industry. Established with an initial capital of about 988 million kwacha, the plantation is one of the projects of the Malawi Innovation Challenge Fund, a 28.8 billion kwacha investment fund that was set up by the United Nations Development Program, United Kingdom and Germany, and other partners to promote local entrepreneurship ideas. UNDP resident representative Shigeki Komatsubara said since its inception seven years ago, the initiative has funded over 70 local enterprises in agriculture, agro-processing and industry, creating over 2,000 jobs. We do not see this as us giving money, no, but our donors and UNDP working together to invest in the future of Malawi by supporting companies and individuals with very good ideas and also willingness to work hard to make things happen. Commenting on the plantation, the director of trade, Charity Musonzo, said the bamboo farm is a departure from the usual and is an exciting business venture that the government will fully support. Uh, it's uh, a game changer because we are looking at the environment and we are looking at the sustainable way of uh, uh, the whole value chain, the way it is brought up and to the level where it's going to give the products that will be an alternative to the source of fuel wood. Working with 18,000 households in communities living around the area, the plantation is producing bamboo-based charcoal as one way of helping control the production and sale of illegal charcoal that is degrading the country's environment. Afriba Managing Director Grant Bloomrig, however, says it is the bicycle charcoal vendor who is giving them a headache. Remember the price that they are selling illegal charcoal for is not including the price of the tree. It's free. So it's just the labor to cut the tree down, make the charcoal, put it on a bicycle and bring it to town. So for me it's difficult to compete directly with that because I have to have all of this investment into a plantation to then be able to produce something like the briquette to compete with the, with the local market. The plantation is also set up a three hectare greenhouse seedlings facility to create a buffer for other local bamboo farmers. It is also applied to the government for an additional 2,000 hectares of land as part of its expansion drive. I am Marissa MBC Mchinji. Tikuona kuti zintu za suntanditu, choke ambali ntaimeneti mayamba. Kwa chaka jimene cho, tinali ni ma project wa fupi naini. Kwa makufikira lero, tili ni ma project kudusa 50, ziko rose la malami. Ndipo ndi mbali zo siyana siyana. Kwa ma project kwa mbili, amene tima kazikisa kudzera mbungo ila MICF. Ndo kudza na kuti ma company, amu no malami, apange business. Aka mapanga business, mtu wako mtu na yeso pa mapirobaki na yeso atakupeza kompata. Kaya ndi kupeza nchito, Kaya kumapere kila katundu, 